Hello everyone, this is the Shitcoin Detective and today we'll take a look at how to make sure that your wallet is safe from scammers or they, they have access to your funds in it. And I'm going to show you later how a safe wallet looks like and how uh, someone who has been hacked, well, it's not really hacking, I'm going to explain to you how exactly they get access to your wallet. But first, you want to head to Polygon Scan and go to MISC right and then token approvals and then you take your wallet address and you input it here right and then it will do a search uh, based on uh, you know on your tokens and based on your approvals and it's going to show you uh, if it's safe or not so i found your wallet it was just a random wallet uh, online trading one token which is safe if we take a look at here uh, we can see that the approved spender, this is what you want to check basically, uh, the approved spenders are here. He has only access on QuickSwap, which is a safe website, right? And something called dual staking rewards, it must, must be you know, Uniswap staking or something like that. If you recognize something that is uh, the approved spender, you don't. if you don't recognize the approved spender, what you need to do is uh, connect your wallet here, right? Here's the button for it, connect Web3. And you have to spend the minimal amount of gas uh, revoking the con uh, you know, the contract. So what you want to do is click on this button afterwards you connected your wallet. And then the scammer doesn't have access to your wallet anymore. So let's take a look at the wallet who has been scammed, right? So as you can see here, the approved scanner spender is <laughs> the approved scammer. Yeah, that's a very good point. So the approved, this wallet unfortunately connected their, this person connected their wallet to a few smart contracts and approved uh, to be spent unlimited block, which is uh, one of the tokens on, on Polygon probably. And um, yeah, and therefore it's uh, it's empty. On another wallet, when I was looking at, uh, you know, I was looking at uh, one of these uh, dusting attacks, and I found this wallet. So at first uh, sight, it, everything looks fine, but when if you scroll down, then uh, here is, for example, something that uh, cannot be recognized is allowed to un spend unlimited uh, wrapped ether, and there is another few which uh, has been authorized to spend. WBMB and and wrapped ether. So well, for this person, the best course of action they can do is uh, uh, revoke the approval. The other thing I can suggest is create a new wallet and transfer out your funds into it, right? Any tokens that you have in it, because then the approval starts from zero. So. The only downside is that you need to have a little bit of, of uh, Motic in this case in your wallet to do these approvals, but it can be very small. I think uh, a few cents uh, worth of Motic might be enough to do this uh, token approvals. But why, if you have, if you have by any chance the scammer has access to transfer out your Motic, then you know when you put in some extra, they can transfer it out right away from your wallet so it's a little bit risky to do uh, having a new wallet is a you know clean slate it might be better in some cases and let's verify this so if we take a look at this wallet i search it on on polygon scan and you can see it that they basically have uh, 0.2 motic in their wallet and all the tokens that they have is only only uh, tokens with uh, with the website name in it. So these are these are airdrops. These are scam drops. So what we can see here is that uh, this uh, wallet, this person with this wallet, tried to approve fake phishing too. So tried to approve one of these uh, one of these scam drops. And then didn't succeed, didn't succeed, and then approved something else. You see, then they approved uh, tokens to be transferred by one of these unnamed smart contracts. 
and then their wallet basically was emptied out. So a little bit after the approval, they emptied out their wallet. This will happen to your wallet as well if you if you are not paying attention where you connect your which website you connect to. But uh, if you did that, uh, head to Polygon. So once again, head to Polygon scan miscellaneous token approvals. Input your wallet address. It takes two minutes to do this check, and you can sleep better, or you can see what happened exactly and where your funds are. This has been the Shitcoin Detective. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a like and subscribe to the video. All the jazz. If you want to support the channel, I have uh, my wallet address in the video description. Any amount uh, donated is is welcomed. Take care, everyone. I wish you safe trading.